Hello, I'm Massachusetts Senate President Karen Spilka. I'd like to commend for creating a platform to encourage and sustain the collaboration of so many healthcare providers, academics, businesses, and policymakers on this important issue. Far too many men and their families bear the burden of pain and hardship that this disease can bring. But your work is making a difference. And today I'd like to highlight four areas where our continued partnership is necessary. One, we must continue to raise awareness around screening and the importance of early detection. While prostate cancer can be deadly, early detection can and does save lives. Two, we need to continue to target our joint outreach to communities of color specifically, as the rate of prostate cancer is much higher among Black and Latino men. In Massachusetts, community outreach programs have used state funds to successfully increase education and early detection. I'd like to give a shout out to the Prostate Cancer Foundation for launching its Black Men Know Your Risk campaign this year, as well as to the Latino Health Insurance Program in Framingham, which specifically targets men who are Spanish and Portuguese speakers in the Metro West communities that I represent. Three, We need to ensure that we continue to keep Massachusetts at the center of global biomedical research. And four, we must continue to support those living with prostate cancer. Ensuring equitable access to care for all means supporting prostate cancer patients in the short and the long term. And that means supporting our healthcare and human service providers for awareness raising and research efforts targeted to black and Latino men. I was proud to support $1 million in funding for AdmiTech in our latest state budget. Massachusetts has a history of leading the way when it comes to innovations in healthcare and medical technology and a commitment to addressing historical racial inequities. Far from merely improving outcomes for men with prostate cancer, I am very hopeful that with the talent that our state is assembling, we can create a cancer-free future so that prostate cancer is no longer a threat to our friends, neighbors, colleagues, and our loved ones. As Senate President, I pledge to continue to support men who are battling prostate cancer to help deliver the care and treatment they need and work to ensure that people have every opportunity to live long and healthy lives. Until that cancer-free future is in our grasp, I encourage all men to talk to their healthcare providers about prostate cancer. And I encourage all of us to continue the fight for cancer awareness. Thank you so very much for all that you do to ensure a healthy future for the men of Massachusetts. Be well and please take good care.